I demand recompense. Oh. Okay, that's not what I expected here as soon as I started. Anyway, welcome back to more Final Fantasy 16. In the last video, we came down here to help look for Martha. Um, after reacquainting ourselves back at the hideaway. And this is the first time I'm playing this game with a new controller. That's right. I've been using the white controller that came with the PS5 this entire year. And it was the only one I had. And I finally got... Uh, red V or V Red or whatever it's called because there's two red controllers. I think I got the newer one and the other one's more matte esque. And Momo's in front of us because she's in eh, not necessarily trouble, trouble, but you know, I don't like want the kids to get too angry at her because they don't understand her condition and that she's not trying to be mean with her claws but she certainly can't help herself sometimes Momo yeah I love you what are you doing come on hey come with your baby yeah come right there ow ow <laughs> oh no what are you doing you don't Need to leave the chair. Stay up here. Momo. Your BB. I'll make you comfortable. Look. Move it. Blanket. Look at the blanket. Just lay on the blanket. Yeah, it's nice. It's soft. It's comfy. You like laying on blankets. Oh, I should do that. Such a good boy. Oh yeah, I also got uh, new Final Fantasy Play Arts figures. Um, I had... Up ahead. What about up ahead? Oh. Oh. Are you hurt? Don't worry, Loki. It's them at the Abbey who need you. You have to do something. Tell us what happened. What happened? The damn black shield says what happened. The black shields? The Abbot and I were helping Baird. They were gonna hang us both. But the sick rose from their beds. Poor souls turned to the Imperials. They distracted them long enough so they could get away. Then they may still be alive. Martha, do you think you can make it back to the inn? Cole is there with the other curse breakers. I think so. Thank you, Clive. She slowly makes her way back. But anyway, I got new play arts figures. Uh, I already had uh, normal Aerith, Aerith in the red dress, Yuffie, Tifa in the exotic dress, and Sephiroth was the last one I got before yesterday's came in which was Cloud and Jesse where, where they came with the motorcycle which is interesting because Cloud has a solo one uh, Jesse has a solo one and Jesse actually has another solo one that comes with a bike as well which is about as much is what I paid for for the one I bought, but the, I bought it on a sale, so that's why they're roughly the same price. So it's like I no longer have a reason to buy just normal cloud. Yeah, gloom. But it's so good. It doesn't have like the the flap 
open like all the others do. So that means my next targets are uh, Red 13 and Barrett and regular Tifa. And maybe her other two dresses, which I think is sports and something else. But it's the Chinese looking one. I got the one that was Japanese looking and then the one that's just kind of like a standard looking fancy dine dress. What, and you think you can stop me? And for their crimes shall they be punished. Such is the law. To dwell in darkness that we may purge the night and welcome lasting dawn. On these our swords we swear. How dare it. you speak those words? Have you no honor? Bye. This won't take long. So let's say that's a lot of fancy speak for what are you doing? Oh, it's triangle. I'm an idiot. Hey. Oh, I didn't even notice him. Oh, I'm close to leveling up. That's nice. Is that all of them? For now. I think so. Huh? Whew. Oh, sweet. I leveled up. Interesting. It's not expecting to get one of those. He may still be alive. Uh, I kind of doubt it. Ah, uh, poor bastards. But yeah, if you can get the the double pack, just get the double pack. Unless you just don't want Jesse, but I don't know why you wouldn't want Jesse. Their face is gone. The bear has died protecting him, calling upon what little magic they had left in their bodies. Clive, he's breathing. Mm -hmm. Save him. Tell Martha to 
Mr. Banks. Yeah, that was a big thing. We did it. This wasn't your fault. Can I picture? I shall. If only he knew I'm Sid. In here. We found a survivor. Clive. He's gone. See, the music matched the tone in that scene. Why couldn't they have done that for Sid's death? <laughs> for those who fought for them. Arthur said they rose from their beds, threw themselves at the Imperials as she and the Emma could escape. I've gathered the bearers' remains. We should consign them to the tide. There's a drawbridge not far from here. Redux jump. The currents there are swift. If the Abbot was still with us, he'd have taken the dust to himself and performed the casting. I'll get someone to... I'll do it. Of course. Cole and I will remain here and see to the Imperials. Release. Okay, but I get Torval. You get Cole, I get Torval. It's only fair. Better not fight. Any respawn spiders, but I know there's going to be respawn enemies over here, unfortunately, including an annoying, like, that horseback dude. Man, why do I gotta, why do I gotta go a long way, dude? I wish I could just cut across, <laughs> but no. Oh well, it is what it is. I don't know, playing this game just makes me excited for Rebirth. Probably should be the other way around. Oh, what? What the fuck? Clive Bane counter creatures larger, faster, and more ferocious than most. While fight is always an option, defeat these. <sighs> but are also rare materials that we use. Man. I don't know how to use that exactly. I don't know what that is. Oh, jeez. Did you not do that?
I mean, yeah, you can try all you want, my man. That was rude. The hell? Do I just... What the fuck? Well, yeah, they did that when I was doing something. It's fucking bullshit. Yeah, okay. Ah, she's dumb. That's what that is. Oh, come on. Bullshit. I'm sorry, excuse me. In what world does that count as a hit? Did you just go away? The fuck? Yeah, game, I'm pressing R1. What what do you want from me? So fucking mad game. My god, I'm getting so annoyed at your stupid freaking bullshit, dude. Like, that one should not have counted. Uh...
Jeez. Really? Well, yeah, he's- what are you doing, game? Fucking guy's right there. Really? What the hell is going on? I was about to that feel like you should have. I just got caught in a bad doom. I feel like some of those rays shouldn't have hit either. You didn't see that coming. Oh my god. Let me give him love. Thank you. Alright. Beautiful. Lovely. Oh. Doomed made that fight more annoying than it had any right to be. That must be the bridge. Yeah, just let me pick up the items and then we'll go to the bridge. At least it's gone. The, the stupid giant creature. Back to Martha. I'm assuming Martha. Yeah. But yeah, the 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 Arahim or whatever the hell it's called. I mean, if it didn't have if Doom was an insta kill, I don't know, man. That's just annoying. <laughs> I got caught in the Doom when I was doing my shot lock thing. Well, trying to figure out how to do it anyway. Because in my mind, I'm thinking like it is exactly like Shylock, but it's not. Thank you, Founder. I didn't do nothing. It's also a lot slower than the Shylock, too. Um, but yeah, I got caught in Doom when I was doing that, and I had no idea I was caught in it because I was like... Your vision's heavily obscured when you're in the the thing. What you after? Nothing too big. Oi. Much obliged. There you go. Well, that's right, I haven't bought that because it's ten grand. I demand you shut the fuck up. Return to the hideaway as 
as soon as we finish our administrations. God, like I was about to demand you go back to the hideaway immediately. No one survived then. I'm sorry. Before we passed, one of them bade me tell you not to blame yourself. Doesn't mean I will. Doesn't mean their blood's not on my hands. Cole said you cast their remains. That was good of you. But it should have been me. This was all my fault. No. You couldn't have known. But I did. And I turned a deaf ear to the warnings like the fool I am. The rumors started moons ago. Of black clad devils descending on the villages in the dead of night to slit the throats of sleeping bears. I assumed it was all just nonsense concocted by the Empire. Nothing but a ghost story meant to make folk think twice about lending a hand to a fugitive bearer. And in ordinary times, you would have been right. What these black shields are doing is unthinkable. Which begs the question why do it at all? My mother obviously has a hand in this. I cannot make sense of her actions. And picking what goes on in that woman's head is a job for someone with more time on their hands. Right now, I need swords and men to wield them, preferably big ones. And if those Imperials think they can come in here again and threaten my people, they're in for a rude awakening. Oh, before I forget, a Stolas from Otto landed just before you arrived. He asked me to tell you that Gav has returned. Then we must as well. Will you be all right here, Martha? We can't stay longer if you wish. No need. I'll be ready should the Imperials come calling. Though I wouldn't turn my nose up if you were to lend me a pair of them strapping young curse breakers. More sellable. Those poor souls died to give me a chance to save others. I won't let their sacrifice be in vain. What in the world is going on? If you don't mind, Sid. I'd like to stay here with Martha. Just until she finds someone to guard the rest, that is. Martha's a stone soul boring. Anyone else will be out cold after what she's been through. Never down raw, lest bitter juices inspire violent retching and loose bowels. Okay. Chattery will be prepaid with a swift boot to the arse. Fingering? Foisting, palming, peeking, packing, stacking, mucking. I don't know what half that shit is in context too. I'm lacking context there. But I guess I can use my imagination and I don't really want to on that one. Yeah, I'm going to talk to you. The hell are you? Oi, you there. But don't just pass me by. Are you handy with that sword of yours? Of course you are. Bet you're a bloody marvel with the thing. Now, the question is, are you willing to use it or not? Because a flock of noble chocobos are in need of help. Chocobos. You heard me right. Wild birds? The big ones? And not just any chocobos at that. My card and her flock are the bravest birds you ever did see. They protect travelers round these parts from bandits and the like. Chocobos. Fighting bandits. It's true. Why, they saved me from a gang of butchers only yesterday. As did not they were too. And now they're back. Looking to settle the score. Go on then. 
Don't just stand there. Go and help him. Why is it a plus? What's the plus sign for? All right. There's a good lad. Where can I find these chocobos? I saw him cut across the way over yonder. The rotten scoundrels were driving the poor things towards the old dock. It's a dead end, that is. You save White Heart and her flock, you hear me? There ain't a pluckier bird in all the world. She's a hero to us locals. And don't worry. You'll know her when you see her right now. I'm sure I will. Good luck to you. I give those no good bastards a hiding from me. It's a white winged wonder. It doesn't look like there's anything else like that on this map. Interesting. So I wonder what this is then. Like the insignia. That's quite a name for a chocobot. It is actually. It's pretty cool. Pretty badass. Oh, you didn't need to stop running. Pick that up. Just because I can and it's right there. Fascinating that you can just tell that. Hey man, if I can get around you without fighting you. That's a win in my book. I don't need to fight everyone. I mean, they do say they fight. Quite the the luck in doing that. Jeez. Nice. Oh. Come on. Oh, I'm pressing our fuck off game.
Oh damn. Oh, fuck off. Jesus, game. What the hell, game? Why? Come on, I'm trying to proc precision dodge and you're just like, Oh, I think you dodged into the attack. Like, really? Okay, fuck off. I just, I don't understand you. Sometimes you precision dodge, sometimes you just like, mm, no, nah, I think he's just gonna hit you again and you can't do nothing about it. <laughs> Buck beak. You're safe now. White heart, I presume. Your chocobo. Ambrosia. It is you. You survived. And you found yourself a flock. Thankfully they did. And not only that. Well, I'll be. I never stop to think our hero here might once have been someone's mount. <laughs> Though I dare say she'd suit a fine fellow like yourself. Reckon our feathered friend must have learned a thing or two from her master. Kind-hearted warrior that you are. A bird like her would have cost a princely sum. You born a lord or something? Well, I... Uh... Oh, no, sorry, sorry, I, I didn't mean to pry. No matter who you are. You done right by me. What is it, girl? She wants her master back, I reckon. <coughs> Told you, and it seems her pals agree. Is that it? You want to come with me? me if this ain't a heartwarming sight. Lads down the stables will be hearing about this tonight. Oh, stay right where you are. Doesn't she cut an handsome figure, eh? She does indeed. How 
much do I owe you? A few scraps of leather, the very least I owe old Whiteheart. Oh, I'll be sad to see her go, of course. But she's earned her right to happiness and more besides. Don't you worry, we'll get along just fine without her. You hear that, Whiteheart? You've earned yourself some time off. You have fun traveling with your master now. Familiar now I get a proper look at you. That's it. When those chocobos swore my car on the road, didn't you? And... No. That can't be right. That fellow was a bear. Must have been my double. Must have been, eh? <laughs> now that'll be the excitement getting to me. Silly sod that I am. Pay me no mind. <laughs> Anyhow, I must be on my way. Good luck to the both of you. You take care of your flock for now. I'll call you when I need you. Just tack. After eighteen long years, Clive has finally been reunited with his faithful steed. Hold R3 while on the field to summon Ambrosia and X to mount. Oh. Well, yeah, I mean, we gotta try it once. Nice. Or three to hard stop. Time to fight. Or is it? Yeah. Oh, that's great. As great as that is, there's uh, nothing to do anymore. Right. So it's time to, to go back. Of the world map. And there's nothing anywhere on the screen. Where's Gav? Oh, it's always here at the door. Gav should be back by now. And I think we'll talk to Gav in the next episode because uh, it's at 44, 45 minutes. Yeah, we did a lot. We helped Martha and helped our old Steed. So that's that's nice. Uh, so in the next episode, we'll go talk to Gav. Hope you have a great day, Marvel. You can be the best you can possibly be. If you like the video, then that means you got your own Ambrosia back. And that's all we could ever ask for. Ta-ta. For now.